friends, this is your boy Mir, the Kashmiri stew, red stew recipe. Stay tuned and enjoy the recipe. Now let's move. This is our steamer. You're gonna use a steamer in there. I'm gonna add enough oil because I'm using three pounds of beef in there. So you're gonna add enough oil. Onion, ginger, and garlic paste. So you, you can, I mean, you guys should use one onion, four cloves of garlic, and I would say a tiny piece of ginger in there. And you guys should add some water and blend it up. So you're gonna add this part here. Fry our onion, ginger, and garlic right there. So we're gonna wait until this is slightly brown. So guys, our onions are brown. Let's add the beef in there now. So this is our three pound beef. We're gonna add all in here. I know it looks cold, but it, it's gonna shrink when it's cooked though. We're gonna just stir fry the beef for at least maybe five minutes. And then we're gonna add our seasoning in there. So this is Kashmir red chili powder. This is not spicy, it gives nice flavor and color to the stew or whatever you are making. So we're gonna add at least four spoons of that. Adding some cloves and carom seeds. So this, uh, this is called actually bishop wheat. Some dried Indian bread chilies. What we're gonna do, we're gonna just break it and put it right there. Just like that. One and a half spoon of salt. So half teacup of water. Some tomato sauce. This is optional. I mean, if you guys wanna add fresh tomatoes, you can do that. So we're gonna give it a stir. I mean, these pieces, the beef pieces are big. So I'm just trying my best to give it a stir. Now I'm gonna just cover this up. And the steamer and steam it at least for 35 minutes so guys we're gonna just cover our steamer as usual we're gonna put the seal on top and leave it for 35 minutes So yeah guys, it's been 35 minutes and our meat is super tender. Let me dish this out and show you guys the final red stew product. 